Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. How can I resolve boundary disputes using land records in South Carolina? To resolve boundary disputes in South Carolina, it is crucial to start by gathering and analyzing land records. Here are the steps and details to guide you through this process. Obtain a professional survey. Hire a licensed surveyor to physically locate the boundary of your property based on the legal description contained in your deed. This survey will help determine if your boundaries are where you believe they are and how much land might be encroached upon. Review deed descriptions and plats. Examine the descriptions in deeds, plats, and other modes of conveyance. These documents can often clarify the original intent of the property boundaries. Historical research and extensive land record research are key in recovering evidence for the original boundary. Check county records. Visit the county's Registry of Deeds office to access signed and sealed survey plats that have been recorded. Copies of these documents are also available at the SC Department of Archives and History and the SC Geodetic Survey. Conduct a title search. Perform a full title search to obtain the necessary information about your and your neighbor's properties. This search will help identify any discrepancies or unrecorded deeds that might be causing the dispute. Analyze boundary legislation. Be aware of specific legislation related to boundary clarifications. For instance, the North Carolina General Assembly and the South Carolina General Assembly enacted laws, Session Law 2060-23 and Senate Bill 667, respectively, to clarify the boundary between the two states. These laws took effect on January 1, 2017, and impact approximately 1,400 parcels of real property. Notice of Boundary Clarification If your property is affected by the re-established boundary, ensure that a null notice of boundary clarification null is recorded in the appropriate county. This notice must be indexed so it appears in the chain of title for the property owner. Consult with legal experts. Consulting with an attorney specializing in property law is highly advisable. They can help determine whether you have a valid claim and guide you through the process of resolving the dispute. Attorneys can also ensure compliance with South Carolina laws, such as SC Code SACF 29, which governs foreclosure proceedings for affected parcels. Acquiescence and adverse possession. Understand the concepts of acquiescence and adverse possession. Acquiescence involves mutual recognition of a boundary line by adjoining landowners over a long period. Adverse possession, on the other hand, requires actual, exclusive, open, and continuous possession of the property for a statutory period, 10 years in South Carolina. Communication with neighbors. If possible, Try to resolve the issue through direct communication with your neighbor. A personal conversation or a polite letter can often clear up misunderstandings before involving legal professionals. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning into our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.